Hello, I'm Sarah Thompson. My title is Curator Japanese Art at the Museum of Fine Arts Boston. So in this exhibition at the Seattle Art Museum, Hokusai, Inspiration and Influence, it centers on the very famous uh, 19th century Japanese artist Hokusai uh, and the many other artists during his lifetime and beyond who were in some way influenced by him. I want to show a wonderful painting uh, done by Hokusai himself uh, in the very last year of his life, in 1849, when he was 89 years old. Um, actually 90 uh, by the traditional Japanese count. So here is Hokusai who has lived through 90 years and he is still going strong as a painter, uh, still capable of producing a masterpiece such as the one that you see here. This actually represents a scene in China. It is the, uh, the fabulous uh, waterfall of Mount Lu, which was the subject of a very famous poem uh, by a Chinese poet who lived in the eighth century, uh, over 1,000 years before Hokusai's own time. So here is a Hokusai's illustration of the, uh, the fabulous waterfall uh, tumbling down, and you see the Chinese poet at a ledge overlooking the fall. He's not quite all the way at the bottom. And uh, you'll notice that there is a figure of a little boy uh, holding on to the poet and holding him around the waist. The little boy is a servant, and the reason he is doing that uh, is that the great poet is very drunk. Uh, and they don't want him to tip over and fall into the waterfall that he is appreciating. Um, and so that's why there is this little figure uh, holding on to him so that he can be uh, inspired uh, without, uh, without uh, having a, a disaster follow. So there's a touch of humor uh, in addition to the vision of the grandeur of nature. Uh, now, Hokusai had been fascinated with waterfalls for a long time. He loved drawing water in many different forms, whether waves, uh, ocean waves, rivers, uh, and then, of course, waterfalls. Back in the 1830s, he designed a series of uh, color prints showing famous waterfalls in Japan. So a painting, such as this very gorgeous waterfall painting, uh, was a one-of-a-kind item. It would have been made on commission for a wealthy patron who could afford to pay for the great painter's time to work on something just for him. Whereas uh, the color prints that Hokusai had designed earlier, uh, these were commercial items. They were mass produced, they were sold in stores, and anyone could walk in and buy one. Uh, the typical cost of a print was about the same as an inexpensive meal. There were eight prints in the series. We've put four of them into this show um, because they're just so gorgeous. And you can see uh, several of them. We have a cluster of very beautiful waterfall images. You can see these works and many more uh, in the exhibition, Hokusai, Inspiration and Influence, which will be on until January 21st. So please come and see for yourself.